Hi, I'm Patrick. I work here at Paul Component Engineering. I generally do round stuff, so hubs, axles, all the bits that go in the hubs, clamper stuff, the pistons go inside the clampers. But today I'm here to talk to you about uh, some of the things we check on some of the parts and some of the things we do that just make the parts feel nicer overall. So this, might, you might notice, uh, is the outside adjuster on our clamper uh, caliber, disc brake caliber. And uh, it has these nice indents for the ball uh, plunger, which allows you to set the, uh, the pad in wherever you want it in incremental positions. And in order to make that feel buttery smooth, we made these chasing dies. So we hand chase each part to make sure there are no burrs on the part. So this means that when you go to assemble this, and by the time it gets to you, it's gonna be buttery smooth. Likewise, on the body, we do the same thing with a chasing tap. So every single part that comes off the machine gets this done to it. In addition to checking the threads with go, no goes. And this allows us to see whether or not these threads are good. That's a green, means go. Go. And if it does go, if it does go in this, that's a bad thread. So it doesn't go, that's a no-go. It's kind of hard to see. You got the red, means no-go. So we do that for each side of the pads, pad adjusters, the backing plate, and the caliper body. So every single part gets hand chased to make sure it's just awesome by the time it gets to you. If you have any more questions or you want to check any of this stuff out, you should probably head over to paulcomp.com uh, and uh, or call Travis at extension 206 or 4, 204. Two zero three. That's mine. Six. Six. I was right. <laughs> anyway, cheers. Love you. Bye.